Now, Jermaine, uh, what was the last note that deer hit before he died? The low E natural. Was it on full organ? Yes, apparently so. So you can get that there. And which uh, note is it? This note right over here. This one right here? No, this one. This one? Yeah, the third one. There was a master, wasn't he? He sure was, definitely. All right. So come on, jump in the action. Mainly for full organ, because it means to impress people. That's what Louis uh, decided that he wanted to write, because he wanted to inspire people in his music. That's correct. That's correct. Well, he was known as probably one of the best organists of the French, uh, French uh, time, besides uh, Olivier Messiaen, Charles Marie Vidor, and uh, the other organists uh, who inspired the time. That's correct. So, what does the finale start in? Does it start in major or minor? Well, it, it starts off with D major. D major. And it crescendos all the way up to the top, to A major? Yes. Yeah, it starts off loud, it gradually gets louder. And then like in the middle section, it starts to soften a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then later on in the piece, it starts to build up to the full organ sound. Hmm, isn't that nice? Looks like Vier was one of the best, and his music will always live on. It sure will. <laughs> yeah, he was a great composer. He was a splendid one. Now this is our favorite organ uh, throughout our area. A lot better than any of the other ones we've heard, except for the ones down DC. Oh yes, this is the, how shall I say, well it's a magnificent instrument to play on. It has all the full organ sound, it has all the um, solo combinations, like the principles, the flutes, mm -hmm. and also um, the reed combinations as well, such as the French horn, clarinet, <laughs> and oboe. Isn't that nice? That's very nice. It's amazing what an organ can do because it can it can create so many different things with the organ. Oh yes, you can find like every voice that you can find in an organ. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it's so, like going down. It's like going mix and meld, and it's like a painter and put all these lovely canvas on any piece of music. Mm -hmm. Yes, it, it is. And it's very inspiring to the audience. So what about if we give the audience something else that they never even heard of, showing what a pill can do? Would you say to that? Would you like to? I believe that's no problem. So we um, can do that. So uh, why don't we have the camera come around here and we'll show what the pill can do. All right. So this is the low E right here? Yes, that's the low E right there. So you can press that. This is the pedal note that Vier hit when he fell off his organ? That's right. Okay. It's amazing what an instrument like this can do. Oh yes. So, now we've done our French documentary and we got another one coming up in about eight months. So, hop on here, buddy. Turn around. So until next time uh, that we play more organ music, we'll probably play some from either Vidor or Messian, but we got to work on it first. So until then, we'll see you next time. Here we are at uh, Mercer Burger County Chapel. Now you are planning on playing the finale from Symphony Number no. One by Louis Vier. He was organist at Notre Dame Cathedral from 1900 to 1937. But he sadly died on the organ console during a recital. Is there something behind that? Well, I know um, he was, uh, he had some health problems. Mm -hmm. And then, um, and as soon as uh, he got up from the, um, he was making his way up to the organ loft. And then he told, um, Maurice Dorfle, um, best friend of his, said that um, that 
he will die tonight. And he was just climbing the stairs. That's very stunning. I mean, he, uh, he told everyone that he knew he was going to die, but at least he wanted to die where he was known for on his great cavity co organ oh, at Notre Dame Cathedral. Oh, yes. Now, the two most famous pieces that Vieira is known for is the finale from Symphony No. 1, which starts out at full organ, and then Carillion de Westminster, which is one of his favorite pieces. And that's why we picked this organ right here, because it's a pipe organ from the Aeolian Skinner Organ Company in Boston, Massachusetts. Now, Jermaine, let's perform the finale from Symphony No. 1 by Louis Vier, the, the piece that he is most known for throughout his life and legendary. All right. 